I'm Callie Spooner and I'm an artist from London. The, the installation comes out of a wider project I've been working on called And You Were Wonderful on Stage, which is a musical um, that I've been writing about um, thinking about notions of technological dependency, but thinking about tech, technology or techniques more broadly as um, forms of dependency on other humans, so spe specifically like other hired human beings. Um, so I've been thinking about the relationship between the hired human body as a technology and other forms of technological dependency um, that we might find ourselves situated in today. This show isn't the musical, but it's a number of different, um, I guess, pieces of work that um, I made during the progression of the musical and which I'm still making at the moment and which are going to eventually come together to become a film um, because the musical itself is becoming a film. So what I've got down here at Future Generation Art Prize is I suppose this sort of like in-between moment and um, between the musical becoming moving from being live to it becoming a film. And what I've got in the space is a number of different components, protagonists, um, different objects that in some way are going to become a part of this feature film that I'm making in um, February 2015. And I'm going to keep adding to the room and like developing content for that film um, over the course of the exhibition. So I have um, an opera singer from here in Kiev who uh, is coming into the space every Saturday and she's going to be um, delivering an opera by reading from the opera surtitle display that I explained about. Um, and the operas relate to a number of different current affairs that are no longer current, but were um, current affairs that I made the musical from, um, all of which are exploring these different notions of um, technological dependency. So for instance one of the operas is um, um, about Beyonce lip-syncing at the presidential inauguration rather than singing live when she sang the national anthem. One of the operas is about Lance Armstrong doping his cycling performance rather than delivering it live and then confessing on the Oprah Winfrey show rather than simply saying sorry. But the operas that I've made which are about these affairs are um, all programmed from the YouTube comments of the general public who are extremely upset and devastated about these kind of like failures of authenticity or these like lapses of um, these lapses of liveness if you like. 